it's Bessie LB and I am back again with another review from Trader Joe's. Today is going to be spicy and bougie, baby. It is intense, literally. So today I am going to be reviewing this crazy, crazy eggnog. This here, this old-fashioned baby, that's exactly what it is. Old-fashioned eggnog. As you can see, I, I, I literally only took down that much. And I had this for weeks now. Normally, I get liquor from Trader Joe's, wines, margaritas, whatever. But baby, this is to not be taken lightly. This is to not be played with, okay? First of all, you spend less than $10 for this whole bottle, okay? So if, let me just tell you something. If you don't have this right here, this, this old-fashioned eggnog, if you do not have this old-fashioned eggnog, okay, sitting in your cabinet somewhere, like literally before the season ends, and there will be no more until next year, you need to go and stock up on this. One, if you love eggnog. Two, if you love eggnog. And three, because it's about to be gone. So you bet to get down there and get it. It's super affordable. It's underneath $10. I don't know, like maybe I paid seven, eight dollars or something like that. And I couldn't quite remember. I couldn't quite remember if I loved it, if I didn't like it, what my feel was. Because I tried it maybe like two years ago. So I was like, oh, let me grab me a bottle. Because I love eggnog in general. You know, a little spice of eggnog won't hurt nobody. Baby? Baby? Oh, this will hurt you. This will hurt you. So let me just tell you something. Tread lightly with this eggnog. Because when it says old-fashioned... Honey, it means old fashioned, meaning they don't play with the amount of liquor and whatever they don't put up in here. So let me see. This is our eggnog liquor is a blend of real dairy cream, spiced rum and French brandy. OK, it's mild bodied and pleasantly sweet, presenting a smooth balance of flavors. So let me just tell you about this. Enjoy over ice with a dash of nutmeg or cinnamon for the holiday. Honey. The, okay, so let's see. The liquor content in this thing is 14.75. 29.5 proof. I don't know if they got that accurate or not, because baby, this thing is spiked eggnog for sure. This stuff has you leaning. This is not eggnog that you could just go on ahead and pour a glass like you pour wine. Okay, let me tell you something. I know I may be a little bit of a lightweight, but honey, this, even though it's already mixed with eggnog and the liquor, this is strong, strong, honey. It's strong. Like, I literally poured that little bit for about three cups already, right? But the first cup was literally just sipping this. The second cup was taking some actual eggnog from Trader Joe's version style, pouring a little swig of this inside of the cup, okay? And then I added a little sweetener. Now, I do feel like it has more of a spice because the liquors are strong. And that's probably why it says add nutmeg to kind of top it off and cinnamon to give it a little bit more spice. But it definitely got a little bite to it, honey. It got a little kick. You be like, Kah. like, I'm telling you, hit the back of your jaw. You like, Ugh. so for me, I like sweet drinks. So this is already sweet. I'm not saying that it doesn't have sugar or anything like that. But I feel like if you really love sweet, kick it up with some extra eggnog. Put this inside of it because it's already spiked with the liquor. And then I added like the little simple syrups that you buy, you know, like the little skinny syrups that you buy that doesn't have a lot of calories, whatever the case may be, or whatever you want to add if you want to. I added a vanilla cream that I have that's the simple syrup and I splashed it in there so it made it like mellow out because the amount of liquor that I feel like I could taste that hit the back of my throat, honey, I was like... 
So yeah, I love it. I will probably buy another bottle just to store. It is on the shelf, so I think you do have some time. Like, once you open it, I don't know. The expiration on this says 9-29-2021. So baby, get you some of these. If you love eggnog and you want to drink it throughout the year, honey, get you some of these, store it in your basement, your cellar, your, your cupboards, your wherever you want to store it, honey, and have you some tucked away and then just bring it out when you need to mix it with a little bit of things, honey, because this is only going to be here for the season. It's going to come back next year. So that is my honest review about this. You need to tread lightly on this. This is not a joke. It is tasty as hell, but it is not a freaking joke, honey. It's not a joke. It's strong. It's strong, honey. Strong. I'm serious, y'all. I'm not playing. Go get you some of this. Find it in your local Trader Joe's. If you're not near one, it's worth the travel. Get you some. Get you a couple. Give it for a gift, honey, because baby is good, but it is strong.